so when you're doing things in an inauthentic way, you can't expect to attract the right kind of tribe. When you're authentic and genuine, that's what you attract back. This is Scott Aaron, and welcome to the Success Made Simple podcast. This is a podcast dedicated to teaching entrepreneurs, network marketers, online business owners that success is not made simple, but it takes simple decisions that create the success that we truly deserve. So what I'm going to do each week is bring you guys short quick and effective tips on how to really take yourself and your businesses to the next level. So welcome to episode 11 of the Success Made Simple podcast. So before we talk about today's content, if you're a network marketer, an entrepreneur, an online business owner that is looking to radically change the outcome and the look of your business in 2019, then go to www.thenetworkmarketingacademy.net and join my tribe of up-leveling entrepreneurs and network marketers focusing on mindset, organization, social media skills, and lead generation skills for all of 2019 and beyond. So what I wanted to talk about today was the seven mistakes that most online marketers, network marketers, and entrepreneurs make on social media and how you can correct them. And what I've learned is that I'm a big contributor on Forbes, but I also take a lot of content from them just because they're such an amazing resource for things that are going on. So number one is you don't have a clear avatar. And most people are just posting and praying, putting content out there, and not really understanding exactly who they're looking to attract. And a simple exercise that you can do is when you're listening to this, write down the age demographic of the type of person that you want to attract is. Are they married or not married? Are they male or female? Do they have kids or no kids? What are their hobbies? What are their passions? What do they do for a profession? The more specific and clear you can get with your avatar, the more content you can put out there related to them will have them start responding back to you. So number one, have a clear avatar. Number two, you're using messages and and posting things that provide no value. You're just posting stuff that you find online. You're going to Google and searching inspirational quotes and you're just copying down a couple Helen Keller quotes and you're just posting them, which is great. Everyone needs inspiration, but put your own twist on it. Put your own content and thoughts into what you're talking about. The more that you can make it you, the more value you bring to your network. So don't just copy and post. Copy, post, but use your own content above it. That's number two. Number three, going along with number two, is you lack personalization. Now, everyone, when they get started in network marketing or online marketing or entrepreneurship, you're kind of figuring it out as you go. And and I was there at one point. But the more that you can personalize your message, your mission, your vision, the more that you start attracting the people that are also attracted to that same vision and mission that you are. So really start to personalize your content of what it means to you. That's number three. Number four, giving up. People get on social media. They start posting for a couple months. They're not getting the engagement that they thought they were going to get. And what's the easiest thing to do? They throw their hands up in the air and they said, I give up. I quit. Well, quitting is the best way to automatically fail because you have no chance of succeeding. So instead of having a perceived outcome of what's going to happen in 30 days, 
follow the compounded effect where small daily actions will produce the return on what you're looking to receive from your business. So don't give up, don't quit, keep moving forward. That's number four. Number five, most people are selling time. They're selling this. What you have to understand is that you're sharing an opportunity to create an amazing and abundant life. So you're not selling time. People are sending these long drunk log messages out to their networks, whether it's on LinkedIn or Facebook or Instagram. That's time. People don't want to take the time to read through all that. Get right to the point. What you're looking to do, get them on the phone, share your story, build connection and rapport and relationship with those people. That's what's going to attract the right tribe to you. So when you realize that you know, time is very precious. It's, it's the most valuable commodity we all have. You don't want to take it from people. You want to give it to them. So when you realize that you're selling an opportunity to change someone's life, you're not selling the time. That's when things start to change. Number six, you have no system. You're literally flying by the seat of your pants. Every great entrepreneur, every great network marketer, every great business has a system in place. And network marketing is no different. If you really want to achieve great things in your network marketing opportunity, you better believe that you need to have a system in place for everything. What time you get up, what time you go to the gym, what time is your first post on Facebook or Instagram or LinkedIn. You have to have your own system in place that leads to success. If you have no system, it leads to overwhelm, anxiety, and it leads to inconsistencies. So the more consistent you are with a system that you have in place, the more you're going to succeed. And finally, number seven, you're not authentic. I'm a very big believer in showing vulnerability, showing authenticity each and every day. Because that's what people are really attracted to. They're attracted to you. They're attracted to your message. And every day is not going to be sunshine and rainbows. Plain and simple. It's not. So the more authentic you are with your words and what you're looking to enable people to achieve with something that's working for you, that's when the wheel starts turning in the right direction. So be authentic in every and all way possible. So again, the seven mistakes that people are making on social media and how you can correct them is number one, you don't have a clear avatar. Figure out who that is. Write down specifically what that person looks like, what they do for a living. Then number two, you're using messages that provide no value. Make sure when you post, you provide value. You provide content. You you provide a takeaway for these people. Number three, you lack personalization. You're just mimicking what everybody else is doing. Be your own person. Be a salmon in a world of fish. Number four, you give up and quit. That is the first and easiest way to failure. Don't quit, don't give up. Number five, you're not selling time. Do not suck people's time with huge long messages. Get get to the point, let them know that you're there to share an opportunity and get them on the phone. Number six, you have no system in place. With no system, there can be no success. And number seven, you're not authentic. The more authentic you are, the more better of a business. You will grow, the more people you will inspire, and the more successful you will become. So guys, I hope you found this content valuable, and I wish you all a great rest of your day, and I will see you next time. Bye, everybody. Test, test, testing one, two. So I just wanted to first start by saying thank you so much for all of the people that support the Network Marketing Made Simple podcast. And I talk to so many people that want to start their own podcast and they hire this company and that company. And what I love about Anchor, which is the platform that hosts my podcast, it's free. You can create your own background music. You can edit your podcast right from your phone. And the other benefit is that Anchor distributes your podcast to Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Pocket Cast, all the other ones. And if you want to monetize it, if you want to make money from your podcast, 
there's no minimum listenership. You will get ads and sponsors if you choose to, and it's everything you need to make a very successful podcast that benefits people. So if you haven't downloaded the Anchor app, download it and go to anchor.fm to get started, and it will change your business and your life because it will allow you to reach that many more people. Thank you again for checking out this episode. And if you could, go on to Apple Podcasts or iTunes, Success Made Simple Podcast by Scott Aaron, and please leave a five-star rating, leave a review. And if you're interested in up-leveling your network marketing business, you want to up-level your mindset, you want to up-level your organizational skills, you want to up-level your social media skills and your lead generation skills, then go to my website, thenetworkmarketingacademy.net and join me in 2019 and beyond and become part of a private community that is structured around up-leveling every aspect of your business, just go to www.thenetworkmarketingacademy.net, fill out the application to join, and I'll see you on the inside. See you next time, guys.